So here we are back at the DW Stadium for the first and a new feature called Simon Super 8 Stories. After away days finished, having every ground bar the obvious Catlands missing. First Super 8 Stories come from Leeds. Away trips to Leeds haven't been that fruitful for me. Two visits so far, two defeats. Just the six for today's game is this is the 13th game against Leeds overall for me. Eight wins, four defeats so far. Obviously, of the four defeats, two of them were at Huddingley. So we're moaning two there. It's my 150th Wigan game as the season's get older. That dates back to Grand Final 2010. It's the 46th game of the year for me. So 50 is a very high prospect in the Super 8s and the Academy. So, oh, more news a little later on. So here we are at Hedling Carnegie Stadium. One of the most unique stadiums in Super League because it's two parts. Obviously we have the cricket ground which we'll be walking around in a minute. Let's pull through the turnstiles over there. Programme which is three pound. Oops, here we go. It's the blue and amber. Three pound of course. So just up on the west terrace now. As you can see over there, the Sky Sports. Obviously there's nobody at the screen yet, but that'll come later on. Bit of pre-match entertainment here at Eddingley. Bit of kick and clap, Union, Yorkshire Carnegie game, Romania. It must have been a really exciting game because it finished 10 all, 20 points. I'd expect probably that amount in the first half here tonight. Leeds versus Wigan, 8 o'clock. Spitting at the moment, not heavy rain, so shouldn't be too bad. So, visitors come out to warm up first, Wigan, as expected. <laughs> Teams currently being read out. No surprise in the Leeds, strongest backfire in the competition this year. Ardacre, Briscoe, All, Watkins and Moon. Currently Wigan warming up, still waiting for the home side. Rain's starting to come down just a little bit now. Many vocal support from the home side, as you would expect to be honest. Cheerleaders come out to the middle, and last time I couldn't remember what they were called, and I still can't. Oh, hang on. I think it's just called the Rhinos Dance Team, I think. East Stand starting to fill up a bit. On the side, come out to warm up. And the second they come out, the rain gets just that little bit heavier. This will surely help Wigan more than it help Leeds, because Leeds aren't a very good side in the wet. We saw that when they played St. Helens the other week, and it was like watching basically a bunch of rugby players trying to play with the beach ball, not on cookie ball of it. And seam in the middle, obviously, Leeds on the far side, Wigan warming up as well. West Terrace, where I'm currently in, currently warming up quite a bit. So the weather's definitely not defied anybody, but then it is a Friday night as well. Continue the entertainment, Lawrence Robinson, obviously famous for a lot of Wigan fans from the time he used the Wigan shirt at the DW in the playoffs last year. So Leeds can claim him all he wants. He wore a Wigan shirt to the DW, that's enough for us. Obviously the rain coming down a little further, we're just 10 minutes still kick off at the moment. But a bit of rain never hurts anyone, did it really? How do you think we'll do tonight? <laughs> so just move down a little further, obviously his umbrellas are starting to get in the way, so this should be a bit of a better view for us. Rain's still pouring down, of course. Another perk of Leeds is that you're right near the airport. Do you see the plane? It might look small on the video, but it is literally right above us. About, now I say, about five minutes till kickoff, I think, ish. Out come the teams. Vocal support from both clubs, of course. Hack Wigan in despite the rain. Come on, the famous lead song I thought was Sink and Swim and actually a CU win, so that's one I learnt last week. 
Leeds against Wigan, 8 o'clock kickoff. Let's hope for a good one. Half time here at Edinley, and no surprise on my third visit, we're going to lose it. We get to lead, I think. I think we led twice in three years here, I think it was early on. Half time, Leeds 20, Wigan 4. Come on, Wigan! So how come Wigan for the second half and after the first half to forget for the Wigan fans? This has got to be a lot better. Maybe kicking towards their own fans might help Wigan because in the first half nothing else did. Second half, due to kick off here at Eddingley as Leeds Rhinos come out. Half time score, Leeds 20, Wigan 4. That needs to change the double figures very quickly. So, not the best way to start the Super 8 stories with a defeat, but then away days also started with a defeat. Full time here at Eddingley Carnegie. Leeds 25, Wigan 18. So, now 0 3. It's a new record.